I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a tornado siren. I take one finger way over here on the left and I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw curve line down, curve line up, curve line over, connect. I come on the top side and I draw a straight diagonal down. I come to the bottom and I draw a straight diagonal up. Right here I'm going to draw a curve line connect. I come right on top and I draw a straight line, straight line, straight line down, straight line over, straight line up, connect. I come up to this corner. I draw a straight diagonal out, straight line, straight diagonal down, connect. Right at this corner, straight line down, straight diagonal down, and connect. Right about here, I'm going to draw a big straight line all the way down off the page. Next to it, big straight line off the page. Come up to the top. On the left, I'm going to draw one, two, three, four, five little straight lines. Inside this space, I'm going to draw a straight line straight line, straight line, connect. I come over to the upper right hand corner and I'm going to draw a spiral, keep it going, down, 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 and leave it floating. Come all the way down here at the bottom, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Come back to the first one. Straight diagonal up, down. Straight diagonal up, down. Straight diagonal up, down. Come back to the first one. Straight line, straight line, straight line, dot. Straight line, straight line, straight line, dot. Straight line, straight line, straight line, dot. Come over to the first one. We're just going to go straight line out, down, connect, out, down, connect, out, down, connect. Okay. Right above and intermittently throughout the drawing, we're going to draw little baby circles. And this represents the kind of weather that we have when it is a tornado. This is a tornado siren. Okay? Alright. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to use is my gray. And I'm going to color in this entire space. If you don't have gray, you can use a black and color lightly. I'm going to bring it all the way down, this space also. Now, all of these baby circles, I'm also going to do gray because these represent hail. Okay, tornado weather can have rain, but usually it has hail. So these are all my little hail spots. All the way down. Everybody's going to have a different amount because we all draw differently. Next, keeping it simple, I'm going to use blue-violet for these spaces on top. Blue-violet. And then I'm going to use my yellow green for these two spaces just for a pop of color. Now possibly the most important part 
of coloring, I'm going to take my blue violet and to show that the weather is turbulent, I'm going to first draw some spirals because this represents the wind going kind of cuckoo, kind of crazy. Okay, spirals, any which way you want. Okay, and here's our tornado up here, but it's a little bit further away. Then, once I've filled this all in with turbulence, now I lightly loop-de-loop -loop with my blue-violet over the spirals, and it can hit the hail. It's okay. Keep going, keep going. Oops, I forgot one more thing. Don't forget the top. Don't forget the sides. Okay? Lightly though, not real dark. Once you've done that, your picture should look like it's gonna need that tornado siren immediately. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my tornado siren all colored in. Google Tornado Siren so that you can hear what one sounds like. And this whole apparatus does a 360. It goes all the way around in a circle so that the noise that you hear goes all the way around the countryside. Okay, bye-bye.